In this video, I'm going to show you one of the easiest ways to blitz in Madden 23. What's good, guys? We're going to be breaking down the big nickel over G. I've got a really good blitz for you today. We're going to be able to set it up in literally like two steps, maybe even one um, for certain types of pressures. This pressure is really good. If you want to blitz out of a coverage look, what I mean by that is you want to kind of appear like you're playing coverage, but in reality, you're going to be sending some pressure. This is a great little blitz that I like to use. It also is really good because we can use the pressure is going to come from our linebackers, which allows us to keep our cover players pl playing coverage and our pressure players playing pressure now if you're watching this video make sure you hit the subscribe button if you want to get better at madden we do videos like this every single day to help people become better madden players and we actually have a full defensive ebook on big nickel over g now the reason i chose this as my first defense number one i think it's the best defense in the game by far number two it has every coverage that you can actually run in this game so i broke down on another ebook that teaches you how to run match coverage out of this formation and out of other formations formations as well breaks down all the rules of match coverage how it works against every formation that you're going to probably see online how you can adjust out of it who to user it when to change match coverages so if you want to check out all of that stuff again our patreon members get access to everything the link to sign up for the patreon is in the description it's just 10 bucks to sign up and like i said you'll get access to all of our offensive and defensive ebooks all right, guys, so really, really excited today to show you this pressure. It's really simple, but it's really, really effective. And I'm just going to come out um, in the gun bunch. And we're going to come out in any play in Big Nickel over G. Does not matter what play you want to run. Um, we can show it to you out of LB Blitz because that's the basic concept. But I'm going to come out in just a cover three. Um, just this cover, uh, just cover three sky. Super simple. Now, uh, all we're going to do is we're just going to blitz the linebacker right here, and we're going to stand. So we're just going to globally blitz our linebackers. That's the setup. And then you're going to stand in the center just like this, and you're going to see the pressure is going to loop right into the B gap, and you're going to be able to get instant pressure at the quarterback. And the beauty is this blitz works both ways. But if we want to run it to the right, let me just show you this real quick. Sometimes we have to make a one additional adjustment. You're going to see here if we run to the right, we're able to get picked up five on five and they're gonna have time to make a read. So if you wanna make sure that this pressure works against that type of way, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead, you see how this blitzer's blitzing into the A gap? We're just going to crash our defensive line, and you can either crash your defensive line to the left, or you can crash your defensive line down. I'm gonna actually go ahead and crash my defensive line down. I'm gonna stand right about here, and what you're gonna see is this pressure is gonna loop right through the B gap, super quick pressure right at the quarterback. And the beauty of this blitz is it's so simple to set up. Again, you can be base aligned if you want to. And you'll see here, this doesn't look like a pressure look whatsoever. I'm just kind of like, it looks like I'm just trying to shoot the run. And then you're going to see, oh crap, we're running right through the B gap. They're getting screamed at and they've got to make a hot read. This is a great little five-man pressure that you can use. Um, you can run it off of the right or the left side. So let's say we want to run it off of the left. Again, if we want to run it off the left, all we have to do is globally blitz our linebackers. And then we just need to stand right in this little A gap. And you're going to see the pressure is just going to come in super high. Hot. Guys, this is a really, really simple defense, and the beauty is we can play coverage defense from this as well. My favorite way to play to uh, play coverage out of this is to pinch by line, crash by line out. I'm going to bluff blitz one of my defensive linemen, and then typically what I'm going to do is double flat. Um, I'll typically double flat one side, so in this example, we'll double flat the right side, and then you've got another flat over here, and you see just really good coverage, and then it's going to, you know, you're going to get quick shed because it's Madden 23, and because you're in big Nick Glover G, which is one of the better shed defenses in the entire game now like i said this is a universal tip you can do this out of man coverage a lot of you guys like man coverage right now lb blitz the play is completely set up for you all you do is stand right in this little gap right here and you're going to see the pressure is going to scream at the quarterback the beauty of this is it works like i said off of both sides so if we want to we can just stand right in this gap and now we're just going to use her this side guy as you can see he's already going in the b gap so no need to crash your line and you see the pressure is able to scream at the opponent now, we'll say that if they block a running back or a tight end, this blitz can get picked up. So here you'll see the blocked running back will basically step up. And a lot of times he'll pick him up. But you see how the pressure is coming right down the pipe. Well, the beauty of these, this type of blitz this year, uh, I have to say, is a lot of people in this year's game, they really, 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 really like to step up into the pocket. So when you send the pressure right down the middle, um, let me see if I can get you a quick example of that. We're going to send it again here. Um, so we'll just slide or um, do something like this. 
that time we got picked up, you saw we did get a little disengage pressure, um, but we had a little bit of a weird setup. I'll show you it out of LB Blitz. Um, so anyways, back to LB Blitz, and you'll see again, this is going to come right down the middle. So I'm just going to stand right in here. You see the pressure comes right up in here. So if they step up, they're stepping right up into the pocket, which makes this a really, really, really good blitz for the way people are, are trying to deal with a lot of the looping and edge pressures. They're basically trying to step up, step up, step up, and you see they're stepping right up into a pocket that is pushing down on them which is one of the reasons that this blitz is so good guys i want to thank you for watching the video again you can obviously go max coverage out of this as well out of man coverage one of my favorites is just to do something as simple as this right here and you will find a lot of success with this four down lineman pass rush this year and you're going to be lurking right over the middle thanks for watching the video guys if you want to learn the entire big nickel over g defensive ebook make sure you're in the patreon there's a link to sign up down below it's only ten dollars to sign up so if you want to sign up for the patreon to get all of my ebooks make sure you go down to the description Click the link down in the description, and we hope to see you guys over at the Patreon page.